Well, welcome everyone back for another episode of PC Building Simulator. I hope everyone is having a wonderful Thursday. Let's get back to repairing people's computers. Maybe. If the game wants to load. Slowly. Ah, there we go. All right. See if we can figure out where we left off. This one needed an upgrade of RAM, and that was it. Did we get our RAM? Let's see. That's not even where I wanted to go. So, we were going to install memory. Oh, that's right. We ordered the wrong RAM. That's what it was. So, I believe we just didn't end our day. So, let's end our day. And then we should have our RAM that we need. All right. Let's get this RAM installed. And now let's make sure this computer boots. Get all these cables hooked up. Oops. Power it on. Let's see what we get. Oh, it looks like it starts. Let's get the side put back on this. And see what else we've received here. That's out in the hall. Oops. Power it down. Get these cables off. This one can go out in the hall. Maybe. There we go. Let's see. Both of these needed upgrades. That one. Start with this one. Go ahead and get the side panel off of it. Oops, didn't hold that long enough. And let's see, this one needed an upgrade of storage, so let's take the back side of this case off as well. I can get up to these other thumb screws. I think this one was just adding a hard drive to it. Let's get that installed. Did I not order a... Let's look at our emails. I think that's what we were going to do. I shouldn't have ended the day. I should have ordered... Okay, that was the sail away. Here's the hard drive one. So we needed to order I think a terabyte hard drive. Let's what's this one? A five hundred gig. So we need to order a terabyte.
So let's order a hard drive. Barracuda. Maybe these other ones. Looks like it's going to be a Barracuda. And then we needed to see what the system specs were for the sailing simulation game. I think we needed another program for that. Let's get that installed. Put this case away. Let's have a look at this PC. So we can see what it's running. Go ahead and take the side panel off. He's got an R9 280. And eight gigs of RAM. Let's see if we can figure out what Sailaway's minimum specs are. All right. Where is it? There we go. So it needs a 1050 and an i5-6500. So let's run this on that other PC. So hopefully it put that same software on our little USB drive that we can put in here and see what we need to run this. Let's power this up. And let's see if we have that piece of software. Get this installed. Let's see what this, see what this computer has going on. Yep, let's restart. Will it run? Get down here to sail away. The recommended spec. So they're recommending four gigs of VRAM. So a 1050 Ti ought to do it because he's got everything else that he needs. So let's get him 1050 Ti ordered. All right, let's close that out. Get into the shop. Six cards. Let's see. Ten fifty, one fifty five, one sixty five. I mean, technically, this R nine three seventy would do it. Well, let's get this. And let's go ahead and order that stuff so it'll be here tomorrow. Let's 
Let's power that guy down. Let's see what these other... These other computers coming in tomorrow are going to need, so maybe I can go ahead and order everything. Let's see. I hear you work with computers, so my rig is running really slow lately. I'm hoping for 16 gigs of memory. If you can stretch to that, can you get it done in four days? It's not as quick as it used to be. I'm always benchmarking it to see if any changes have made it better. So she's not telling us what she actually has in it. So we'll have to wait until that one comes in. Let's see about this one. Dear Sir Madam, so my rig is running really slow lately. I need 8 gigs of RAM. Let's see. Is 3 days a reasonable deadline? It seems a bit dusty inside. It looks a bit bland in there. Some plastic white cables might make it look nicer. They'd like some plastic white cables. I look forward to hearing back from you, Dennis. So again, we don't know if he's got 4 gigs of RAM or what he's got. Let's see. Hey, things aren't working fast enough. The graphics card isn't up to my high standards. Can you do something about that? I'd like it to be done in 10 days. It looks a bit bland in there, so some plastic white cables might, might make it look nicer. I worry about used parts. He wants an upgrade to graphics card, so he'll want some white cables too. Let's see. We don't have quite two stars yet, so we'll have to wait on that one. But... Since we can't do anything else here, let's go ahead and end this day. Oh, let's not, because don't we have to... This one we need to collect. So now... We've got some new parts available. We're almost up to two stars, so let's end this. Say, because our drive's coming in. All right. Here's our parts. Let's go ahead. So we've got to remove this cable. See if we can't get this graphics card replaced. Which hopefully will finish this one off. Let's see here. That's the one we ordered. Remove, didn't even see that there. Remove this. Now let's install that. Get it screwed down. Let's install this ECI lock. Let's cable it. Make sure it can boot. While well, I put the side pa pa piece, man, I can't even talk. The side pouse, side piece back on. And we booted to the OS. So we are good. Let's shut this down. Get the cables unhooked. Let's get it out in the hall. Too bad this guy can't sprint. All right, let's see. Let's get this one. This one we just need to put a hard drive in. Oops, this is not the right button. There we go. Let's install this hard drive. Let's 
let's get it cabled up here. Let's hook these cables up. Make sure everything runs right. Well, that's powering up. I'm going to start putting the side panels back on here. Sounded like it booted. Let's do the other side. All right, it looks like it booted. Let's power it down. Take these cables off. There's another one done we can put out in the hall. Uh, let's see. This one wanted an upgrade to 8 gigs, and this one wanted an upgrade to 16 gigs. Let's take a look at this one. They want it done by the end of the day tomorrow. Get the side panel off and see what they've got. So it looks like we just need to add another stick of uh, T-Force Dark and Silver from Team Group. Let's see. T fours, dark silver. Oh, I didn't look if it was twenty four hundred or twenty six sixty six. Twenty six sixty six. Let's add that. Let's go set this in the hall for a minute. Have a look at this one. Ooh, this thing's dirty. Get this side off. Get it dusted out first. Oh. Whoa. I think my game just crashed. All right. Well, we'll be back in just a second here while I relaunch this. Well, all right, guys. So we are back. Uh, after that crash, I had to redo a few things. So we may be a little bit behind where we just were, but I'm going to take the side off of here and try to remove the dust from this PC again without crashing the game. So let's see. There we go. Much better. So let's see, this wanted an upgrade to eight. So they've got four already of 2666, so let's go order another 4 gig stick of that. There we go. Let's add that to the cart. Let's just double check, because it seems like I'm always ordering the wrong stuff. Yep, 4 gigs. 2666. Alright. So that one computer needed to be done by... The end of business tomorrow, I believe. Isn't that one? End of day today. And this one's tomorrow. Oops. That's not what I meant to push. Let's go back to the shop. 
Well, let's just go ahead and pay the 100 and get it now for both of them. All right. Get the ram in this one. Oh, actually, first, let's open these. Then let's install RAM. Uh, memory. And let's cable it up. Make sure it boots. Now let's get the side panel put back on it. All right. So that one's done. And let's get this one done. See if we can sneak this in without having to take this big cooler off here. Oops, memory. Oh, good. So let's cable this one up. Make sure it can boot as well. While I get the side panel put on. All right, it booted, so I think everything's good. Get these cables off of it and go put it out in the corridor. Oops, wrong button. There we go. All right, let's go check our email. That one's done. We don't have two stars yet. That one's done. That one's done. Let's see, that one's done. Get rid of it. That one's done. Let's get rid of it. Let's see, we've got some new parts available. Some more new parts. Oh, phone's ringing. And some more new parts. All right. So let's start down here at the bottom. This one wants a CPU upgrade. I'm thinking of thinking I need to upgrade my PC, so the CPU definitely needs upgrading. I was on PC Bay the other day and saw some awesome, awesome plastic white cables. Have you heard of AMD? They're meant to be pretty good. So let's accept that one. And we'll make sure we put some white cables in there. Let's see. Things aren't working fast enough. The graphics card isn't up to my high standards. Can you do something about that? I'd like it to be done in seven days. It looks a bit bland in there, so some plastic white cables might make it look nicer. I worry about used parts. They don't want any used parts. And they want some white plastic cables. Let's see. I've not been looking after my PC. Can you clean it up for me? The fans seem to be working harder than normal. Could you get that done by tomorrow? It's not as quick as it used to be. My son is always going on about 3D Mark. What is that? They just want the dust cleaned out. So let's accept that one. 
Let's see. Hi, PC is super slow right now. Yawn. Can you put 16 gigs of RAM in it, please? I'd like it to be done in two days. I worry about used parts. My brother has team group in his PC. He says they're the best. Let's make sure we get team group. RAM for them. Let's see. Are you available for a job? My rig just isn't up to the task anymore. I want eight gigs of RAM installed. I've never cleaned it out. Is that okay? I know used parts can be cheaper, but I'd like new ones, please. Hope you can help. So they want to upgrade eight gigs of RAM with new parts. So that's fine. So we'll accept that one. What's up? Things aren't working fast enough. Can you put in eight gigs of memory? Can you finish before eight days? It looks a bit bland in there. Some plastic like gray cables might make it look nicer. I think I might have visited one too many dodgy sites. So we got another person who likes to look at porn. Uh, so eight gigs of RAM and completed in eight days. So let's accept that one as well. All right. So we know we've got two people that want plastic white cables and one person that wants gray. So do we buy those in the shop? Do we go ahead and get those on their way? Cables. Let's see, loose plastic, ribbon plastic. Sleeved plastic. Tight plastic, plain white. It says we own these. I'm wondering if we can just use those. So I guess we'll just have to wait until that PC comes in. So let's look at our calendar here. It looks like we've got stuff coming in tomorrow. And then we've got a job that needs to be done by Wednesday. All right. So can't do much more now, so let's go ahead and end this day. All right, so we need to de-dust one. So let's get that done first. Clean out dust. That is definitely dusty. And hopefully the compressed air doesn't crash my game again. Talk about filthy. There we go. We all clean now? All right, so we clean out the dust. Let's cable it up, and make sure it boots. Get all these cables plugged in here. Let's power it on, ooh, fancy. Let's get the side panel put back on because I think we're gonna be good. Yep, booted right up. Let's go ahead and finish this. We'll get it all unplugged and set out in the hall. All of these are upgrades. 16 gigs, 8 gigs, 8 gigs. Oh, let's start with this one and see what parts we need to get ordered. They want a CPU upgrade. Let's see, let's go over here to the email and see if he says what he wants it upgraded to. So he just wants a CPU upgrade. He 
just doesn't say what. So it looks like he's got a Ryzen 3 1200. So. What was his budget of 170? So it's going to have to be this Ryzen 5 1400. So let's get that added to the cart. Let's go put this away. Let's see what this one needs. This one needs an upgrade graphics card. They're currently running a 960. Let's take a look at this one, the graphics cards. Their budget's 325. Let's see what we've got around that 325 range. Well, it looks like the Radeon R9 290. Just not sure if that's better than a... I guess it's better than a 960. Two gigs. Four gigs. Yeah, that's better. So let's go ahead. Let's see. And they wanted plastic white cables as well. Let's get them this R9 290, even though that seems like an older part. Fits the budget. Let's see, so this one needs RAM. Get the side taken off. They're running four gigs. Hmm, let's see what their budget is. Dust, this one, 16 gigs of RAM, budget of 130. I mean, I guess we could just fill up his remaining three slots. See, it's silver, 2400 megahertz. So let's do three of those. Get this off the bench. Take a look at this filthy thing. This one wants an upgrade to 8 gigs of RAM. So let's see, they're running just a basic A data 4 gig 2133. Let's just get another stick of that. While I'm here, let's go ahead and blow this computer out. Even though they didn't ask for it, let's just be nice and clean it up for them. I'm 
much better. All right, let's get this off the bench. Let's take a look at this last one. We can get everything ordered at once. Oh. Side off of here. They want 8 gigs of RAM. So let's just buy another 4 gig stick. Say so, let's go ahead and order all these parts. Let's see, did we have anybody? Is it worth paying for same day delivery? We get some of these things out of our hallway. Let's go ahead and do that. Didn't we finish one as well? Let's see down here. Not that one. D dust. Let's go ahead and collect that. And discard that. Let's get, oops. Let's get the RAM upgraded in this one. There we go. Get the cables hooked up. All right, so it boots. Let's remove these cables, get it out in the hall. Oh, I guess we ought to put the side panel back on it too. There we go. Okay. That's a CPU. That's six days out. That one needs to be done by tomorrow. Let's get this other one that needed RAM done. Pop these open. All right, let's connect cables. Power it up while I get the side installed here. Looks like it boots good, so let's power it down, get it out in the hall. Okay. Let's have a look over here. That was the graphics card. Let's go ahead and collect that. Get rid of it. Like that one. Get rid of it. Which one? Well, 
let's get this one. We go to PC, take shot in the hall. Okay. Let's open up these tabs so we can get all these RAM modules in here. Some memory. There's one. Two. And three. Now, did he say something about cables? No. So let's get the cables hooked up and make sure it boots. Oops. Power it up while I put the side panel back on. Looks like it booted up just fine. All right, let's power it down and remove the cables. Let's see, this one was the graphics card and the CPU. Let's do the CPU next and we'll do the graphics card last. Open that, pop this out. Let's get his new one in. Oops. All right, get some thermal paste on there and let's get his cooler back on. Where's the plug on this one? There it is. Get that plugged in, get these cables hooked up. We can double check that it starts. Power it up. All right, so she powered up just fine. Unplug these cables. And let's get it out here in the hallway. And we've got this last one. Unplug these cables from it. Let's take off this. You didn't need to take that off. There we go. And let's get the new graphics card put in. I think it was this one. Actually, we're going to put that in. Let's give him one of these guys just to make it look a little nicer. Was it the 290? Oh, I guess it can't. It just looked like it could. Oops. 
that. Get that put back on. Get the cables hooked up. Oops. Clicking too fast. Now let's see if she boots. Get the side panel put back on it. Alright, let's power it down and get the cables off. Get it out in the hallway. All right, let's clear these out. Let's collect that one. Let's collect that one. Get rid of it. Let's collect that one. Get rid of it. All right. So we will get to these in the next episode. Um, be sure if you want to catch some more of this content when it comes out to subscribe and click that little bell icon so that you know when another video goes live. I hope everyone has a great day and we'll see you again in the next one.